This coming Sunday is the second week of Advent. We have entered the beginning of the church calendar year and have begun to celebrate the anticipation of what God will do this year. This season of Advent, we are unwrapping the gifts of God given to us, particularly in this time during the story of Christmas. And so this Sunday, we're looking at the story of Joseph hearing from the angel and recognizing that in his angel's message, Joseph has the choice to participate in what God might be doing in the world or to walk away silently. That's the same choice we have. So we're looking at God's mighty acts and God's invitation for us to join them. I also want to let you know that throughout the season of Advent, we have so many amazing activities going on, from concerts to special services, for activities for families and for people of all ages. What has already begun is our Advent devotional. And if you have yet to sign up for that, I encourage you to do so. That is a, a daily message that winds up in your inbox really wonderful way to concentrate on God and all the gifts of the season through a daily devotional. I also want to apologize for any of you who might have gotten an email supposedly from me asking for money. Let me tell you now that I will never ever send an email to a person individually to ask for money. Granted, I'll send a lot of group emails during stewardship time saying, please give to the church, but nothing so specific. So I invite you to uh, be careful with all of those messages that come from me. They might not actually be from me. I think that's part of the trick about listening to God's voice in the season of Advent, about recognizing recognizing God's mighty acts is how do we know it's really God? Hmm. It'll be an interesting conversation for us on Sunday, and I want to leave you with this. It's a quote from one of my favorite professors, Walter Brueggemann, and he says this about Advent. Advent is a time for relinquishing some of the control in order to receive the impossible from God. That's pretty powerful. We'll talk more about it on Sunday. See you then.